Here we have my new x -Carts sticker kit. And I've never put one of these on before, so hopefully we do a good job. So what I'm doing tonight is, this is my first attempt ever at putting on a uh, sticker kit for a go-kart. There's a real art to it. Um, it takes a lot of time if uh, you're new to it. But you've basically just got to work your way through it, try and get rid of the bubbles. Uh, this is not like what you would uh, wrap a car in. It's much thicker because in carts, you know, the same rubbing as racing. Uh, there's a lot of that that happens. So it, it protects the car. Um, now I can mold it with my fingers uh, to a certain degree, but beyond that, that's why we have a heat gun. So I've done the other side. Um, I'd like to do a better job the next time, but it's not terrible. It's not terrible. I've worked out most of the bubbles. And this time I've started with the top and I'm going to the side. So let's see if we do this one a bit better. For a moment, I thought I'd butchered this one, but I've, uh, I think I've recovered and got rid of most of the bubbles. And um, it's not terrible for a first effort, is it? And see how the blue matches the other blue pretty much? I love it, I love it. I think as long as I can do a halfway okay job, I think it's gonna look amazing. So, uh, do I keep going tonight or do I do some more tomorrow morning in the daylight? Maybe daylight. Let's uh, quit while we're ahead, I think. Well, we're working on the front cowling of the cart now, and I've kept some of the old sticker kit on there just to give me a guide of where things should go. So the only old part that needs to be removed is this. The other two, with some degree of success, we've applied. So I'm just gonna remove this with the aid of a heat gun. It should be fairly easy. Without putting it on too much on the new sticker kit, although I'm still, I'm still massaging that into place, so it's not gonna matter too much. And what you're gonna find is that's gonna now come off fairly easily. Nearly there. All right, so now all I need to do is just remove the residue here, clean that up a bit, and that will get filled with that. So at this point I'm going to pick up the heat gun, this is going to help me. Push the bubbles out as you go. Massage it into the groove. I'm just going to heat the bit that isn't applied at all. And what I'm going to do then is going to turn it off. I'm going to take all that off and just squeeze out the bubbles as I go. And now I'm just going to come back to that area there. I can always lift it up if it's really bad, but I think we're pretty close. Not bad. 
bit of residue on there which I can clean off in a second. I'll continue to massage this into the bodywork. That's all right. Well, ladies and gentlemen, the end is in sight. We're nearly there. Just removing the last little bit of old sticker kit, except for a number on the back. I don't have a. Got to get a new number on the back. At the moment, it's just over the old number, so. Clean that up and then the last little sticker and we are done. So I'm pretty much finished now. All I'm doing here is tightening up these bolts that I've elected to put through the artwork rather than put the artwork on top of it. Um, or on top of them rather. I just think it looks a bit tidier, but also it's really handy to be able to take it off if I need to. So yeah, there you have it. What do you think for my first bit of, um, well, my first attempt of putting on stickers? I think it's pretty good. I think it's gonna look awesome.